Miriam Nicole. The global headquarters of this lady's main sponsor are literally yards away from the finish area. The pressure is on her, but look at that. Fastest on the steep sections, fastest through the corners and through the technical sections. Yesterday in qualifying, only Tracy Hannah to come after her. Can Miriam take her first World Cup win since 2011? Been a long time. Let's Cuts look. across the oh, top there. Wow, we haven't seen that. Back on 27 and a half inch wheels. Didn't find the 29, the bigger wheel to her liking. Looks a lot more confident. Took the win last week in Leger Crankworks. Her brother actually raced the Masters World Championships here a week ago and won not just his age category, but set the fastest time of the weekend. So she should have some good advice from him. She looks like she's cuts that turn there as well, Claudia. This is looking good. She's up by 1.58. Well, this is a great run from Nicole. Tane did have a strong finish though, so those 1.5 seconds are not safe yet. Miriam will need to keep that pace. Not off the podium this year, but she's picking up pace down this track. Has gone from red to green at split three. And she might have extended a little bit more then. Yes, she has, nearly two and a half seconds now from Nicole then. Hannah will be at the top. And have some idea what she's got to do then, but this is looking like a strong run from Miriam. Last few years really wrecked by injury for her. But she keeps coming back. She lives not too far away, about a four hour drive away in Montpellier, France, where she's studying to be a uh, physiotherapist. Not a bad line of work when you do this for a living. Gets nice and wide there. That'll give her a good line in this turn as well. Good run, Claudio. Haven't seen her do anything wrong. All right, last three turns now. Don't make a mistake here. But don't hold back either. One gonna, more turn. This is going to put all the pressure on Tracy Anna at the top. The crowd respond. Nicole crosses the line fast. There's nearly three seconds up. It's a 450.9. So well under the time now of qualifying by Tracy Hannah. Only Hannah now left at the top.